Hi friends, welcome to Ask Investment Academy YouTube channel. Banks generally offer interest rates on fixed deposits almost equal to the inflation rate and you have to pay tax on this interest based on your tax lab. There is a way to beat the inflation like investing in stock market mutual funds where rate of interest is not guaranteed. Floating rate savings bond is better option if you want to get stable returns greater than FDs. Floating rate savings bond provides present interest rate of 8.1% which is 0.35% more compared to the interest rate of national savings scheme. Generally banks offers FD interest rate equal to or less than interest rate in national savings scheme. Main advantage of floating rate savings bond is its interest rate increases if RBI repo rate but interest rates on bank fds is fixed if repo rate decreases anyway it will offer better interest rate compared to bank fds and post office monthly income scheme the interest is payable semi annually on jan 1st and july 1st every year its lock in period is 7 years senior citizens from 60 to 70 years have lock in period of 6 years 70 to 80 years citizens have lock in period of 5 years above 80 years citizens have lock in period of 4 years senior citizens can withdraw their investment before lock in period by paying small penalty Interest earned in floating rate savings bond is taxable same as that of bank FDs. If you don't want your money to get locked for many years, there are few banks which offers high interest rates such as Equitas Small Finance Bank, IDFC First Bank, S Bank, Post Office FDs. But remember, investment of each depositor in a bank is insured up to 5 lakhs including FDs, RDs and savings. To know more about this, visit your nearest bank. If you think this video is helpful for you, please like, share, comment and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos on investment and stock market. Thank you very much.